Hi guys, this is Michael Gatewood and what I'd like to do is I'd like to talk with you about adding metadata to your images using the bridge. The first thing that I'd like to do is simply go into the bridge and then at that point I'd like to go in and go to Tools, Create Metadata Template. Let me zoom in so you can take a quick look at it. It's under Tools, Create Metadata Template and then when you hit Create Metadata Template you're going to be creating a template name. I'm going to call this Panels and then at that point I'm going to go ahead and put in my name for the creator of this. Then I'm going to go in and put in a description Color Wood Grain Panels. Then I'm going to put in keywords Panels furniture, wood, grain, comma, let's put in uh, color, stain, and so on. Different keywords that pertain. Then I'm probably, which something I do all the time, is put in a copyright so that it's a digital copyright so that I can make sure that uh, these images, if put online, will be protected. Now here, I gotta tell you something pretty interesting when I go ahead and hit save. When you do this, and you select all these panels, you simply go in here to Tools, and you go into, let's go uh, Replace Metadata, and let's go ahead and let's call this uh, Panels. They're all now copyrighted, but here's what's interesting. In the metadata, you're going to see all the keywords and descriptions on each one of these. But when placed into a website or placed online, this metadata is attached to the image itself. And that means if somebody illegally copyrights or copies and clicks your image and puts it in to a website, you can search through a Google image search or any search engine find these images and find out if they've been illegally used in other websites. But here's what's interesting. It also helps in search queries. <clears throat> if someone is looking for a particular image, these tags will help to make sure that these images are posted under a image search as well. Now, when you go to place these into Photoshop or into Dreamweaver or whatever, these images are protected and have metadata embedded directly into the image. This is a great way to protect your files, help with search engines, and to be able to go in there and put in a digital copyright. This is incredible, and this is the bridge, something you definitely need to be taking advantage of. My name is Michael Gatewood. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.